good morning from Tales of Terra. Another day? Another adventure. <laughs> Today we're going towards Allentown. We have about three and a half hours of uh, freeway driving. Uh, we were here for three days and it was just gorgeous. We really truly enjoyed outskirts of uh, Washington DC as well as the, the nation's capital. This is a working farm as you can tell. Um, there are a lot of equipment and uh, a lot of open space. This is where the farmers live. They are the gatekeepers. There's a, a lovely lady that who helped us uh, as we checked in. Uh, she was protected by a cat, she said on her uh, uh, door as a warning. Uh, after we start talking, she said her cat passed away and her dog is keeping her safe now. At the time of European encounters with historic American Indian tribes, this area was part of the territory of the Lenape. Lehighton was built on the site of the German Moravian Brethren's Mission Station, Cabins of Grace, founded in 1746. It was established as a mission to the Lenape by Moravians from Bethlehem, Pennsylvania, lower on the Lehigh River. During the French and Indian Wars, also called the Seven Years' War, native allies of the French killed 11 missionaries, and Lenape, also known as Delaware, converted Christians at Ganadan Houghton on November 24, 1755. They destroyed the mission village, and only four of the 15 residents escaped. <laughs> Stony Brook near Allentown, Pennsylvania. Uh, it took us about four hours of switching from uh, state highways to interstates to surface roads and we had seen some wonderful small quaint towns and we went through some very narrow bridges and and trucks were just behind us saying that go and go and I couldn't I wouldn't want to go more than 60 miles an hour the trucks were probably going 70 but we made it it's a beautiful place it's in the forest again and, uh, and the campsite is, is fairly full good morning from Tales of Terra another day another adventure today we're at Stony Brook RV and camp resort and definitely it is a resort. We are here for five days. This is our first day. We decided to settle in. Next couple of days we're heading out to Allentown. We're gonna go to Philadelphia and we're going to go visit Valley Ford. Of course we have one more place which is quite interesting. It's Lancaster County. <laughs> they, yeah, they are Dutch Came Amish uh, as we were driving into the forested area and sparse uh, homes around. I could see my fetiest face <laughs> is is getting not worried yet, but she's just thinking, "Oh, are we in the right place?" So green, so beautiful, so peaceful, and of course the park itself was just out of this world. This is a lovely stone house. They had a new addition, but it's it's also got old. You know, I was just looking at all the farm homes, farmhouses <laughs> along the way, and they are not as uh, expensive and big and rich as the ones we have seen. I was wondering what kind of a neighborhood we were. <laughs> yeah, and I told us, do not worry, this is real America. <laughs> are you carrying our daily? Fruits? Fruit, yes. Yeah. 
a wonderful red plum and a wonderful red peach. minutes I season a lot of the locations uh, I looked around and there's really no easy way to get them in and out unless you start moving the whole row so obviously uh, from the setup that we just saw uh, the front garden and the roses and everything else <laughs> looks like that's a that's a settlement <laughs> that's a sign of a settlement they're here they're here for for good this is close enough to Philadelphia it's only only hour and 20 minutes I'm sure it's close to, enough to other um, big cities so perfect place we spent about an hour walking and came back and sat by the pool and we're waiting for the golden hour to take our pictures so now we're going to the premium sites premium sites yeah isn't the landscape beautiful? It's gorgeous. Isn't it? I mean, just a little bit of a patch, but they do it right. Once you do that, it's a corner that your eye just catches and, and you want to explore. And Betty M is getting ideas for our boardroom house. She wants to use these red roses right in front of our entrance of our house. Yeah. This is a quite a nice setup where the RV is settled, is concrete and they've done a good shape. As you come in, the left hand side of the RV where all your util utilities get connected, stay and that's where you probably have your slide extend as well. And in the front where the front door is, they have a nice uh, half round space and, and on the side of it you've got the picnic table it's very convenient way to set up and store an RV <laughs> I'm not sure if you remember the old television series Bewitched <laughs> there was Samantha where she made all the tricks with her nose and, <laughs> and there was a lady across the way Gladys I think what happened around them? <laughs> exactly, and then poor thing. I mean, she would see what Samantha would do, but she cannot make other people believe that because she cannot prove it. Why are you telling me this now? <laughs> well, the reason I'm telling you this story <laughs> is when we go to a new place. Betty <laughs> is so curious. <laughs> She's like Gladys. She just goes out to the window of the RV and she starts checking out what's going on around her. <laughs> nice place for kids to just roam. Just, just kids. Uh, Me too. <laughs> well, you're a kid at heart. <laughs> Honey, I found a teepee. What's teepee? Uh, Indians uh, tent. Oh, Indians tent. Do you think there are Indians here? Here is the TP. Is there an entrance? They did a great job. In my town, uh, we call this Lover's stay Staircase. Say it again. Lover's Staircase. Lover's Staircase. Yes. Oh. Aşk merdiveni. Aşk merdiveni. Aşk, Aşk merdiveni. merdiveni. Oh. oh. We're having carne asada. Yesterday, Etienne did a, a lovely steak and she cooked the whole batch and saved the remaining for today. And uh, a little bit of heating. We've got now a lovely carne asada. Mm. Fair, fair. Fair, fair. Cheers. You too. Finally, we have a campfire. Look at that. Oh my goodness. <laughs>
Y si nos tiramos oh. A que esto sea cierto That's what I thought Cheers, everyone! Cheers, baby!